hello my people welcome back to our another video this is your preet guys if you want to learn how to add table of content on your blog this is now easy with rank math with the help of rank math plugin you can easily insert a table of content in your blogs so if you don't know what is table of content let me show you this is actually the list of heading where we bring together in the beginning of the blog for example if we have multiple headings in the blog post h2 h3 h4 heading we use in the blog post then you can bring them together with the help of table of content and now this is very easy with rank math seo plugin rank math seo plugin has inbuilt table of content option you only need to just insert table of content within your blogs so let's get start this video please like share and subscribe my youtube channel let's get start this video so before we start this video make sure you already have rank math seo plugin and you already connected to your account if you don't know how to set up your rank math seo plugin after you install your plugin you have to go to dashboard option and set up with it then you have to follow the steps and you will be ready to easily set up your rank math seo plugin so here to enable table of content option on your blog you have to visit general setting in the seo rank math seo plugin go to general setting in the general setting look for blogs section in the blogs section you have a table of content title i will recommend keep this same as table of content and then next number two option table of content list style in the list style if you want to keep it numbered or an order you can select it then next we have table of content exclude headings most of people confuse here because they think uh, if they select all these things are included but these this option is to exclude the heading in table of content for example if i want to exclude s6 or h1 you can easily exclude those type or h type of uh, headings will not show in table of content if i choose heading 6 if i select heading 6 anywhere in my blog that will not visible in table of content so let's go ahead click save changes now we will go to our blog post first in the starting i will recommend you to create a complete blog post before you insert your table of content let me pick any blog post here from my blog let me go ahead click on edit okay now this is my blog post and i use h2 heading h3 heading all the headings i have here set here okay the next step first you have to find out where you want to insert your table of content you have to choose that blog section to add blog just hover your mouse in that area and you will see this plus add blog icon click on that and search for table of content or you can go through browse all and you will find out table of content with it here let me scroll down further here in the rank math plugin options okay just click on that table of content rank math table of content okay as you can see now we have table of content here the next step where you want to align this one in the left side just you can easily choose from the upper side here you want to make it numbered or you want to keep it simple here okay and you can align or if you want to full width you want to go with wide width you can align left side you can choose i will recommend do not 
choose this option just to keep it non okay then in the right side here you have option to hide your links if you don't want to show the first link what is Quora you can simply hover your mouse and you will able to hide that particular link even you have you can also add it your headings simply directly in the table of content if you want to make any changes example what is Quora what is about Quora you can simply make changes like that okay then when I hover my mouse to the right side here in the post section in the block right side I have an option for the blocks in the block section table of content by rank math and if you scroll down we have a setting option we have a title wrapper okay if I choose h3 this is the title wrapper this one table of content okay then if you want to exclude further again you can exclude by selecting here for example it I don't want to include h2 heading or heading 2 just I will select this one this will be hide it from here h2 heading will be hide it okay then advance okay now the next option here in the style you can change the style of table of content like you can change background color text color and the size if I click on small medium large you can see we can change the size of our table of content if I go to background even I can simply change my background of table of content here like that okay then in the select option in the text option you can easily if you are choosing dark background color then you need to change your text color to white so it will be more visible like that okay and the table of content only will be visible if you properly choose your headings you must have a different h2 h3 h4 heading if you did not exclude any of your heading you make sure you have properly set your headings before you insert your table of content in your blog so this is how it is easy to insert table of content in your blog post okay so if you want to move your table of content anywhere in the next heading you can simply click here move down it will be moved down easily this is how it is easy to insert table of content in your blog post if you have further question you can leave comment uh, you can ask me question in the comments i will definitely reply you there thank you so much for watching this video i appreciate that